You know, it seems strange now, but I used to recommend a quarter drill to anybody who wasn't going to use it every day. Why, you might ask? Because just when you needed your cordless drill most, the battery was dead from sitting on a shelf too long, or you just forgot to recharge it. Well, times have changed, and so has the cordless drill. These days, it's all about voltages, clutch settings, variable speeds, and lots of bells and whistles. Some you'll use, some you won't. Let's talk batteries. Now, most cordless drills come with a battery. The question you need to ask yourself is, how much time are you gonna get out of that battery? Now, I've used a lot of drills, and take it from me, you want at least five hours of working time. Otherwise, you're gonna spend your whole weekend charging batteries. Here's something to look for when buying your power tools. Lithium ion batteries. Lithium ion batteries are great because they last longer. And it's okay to leave these on the closet shelf for months at a time. They'll hold the charge. The downside, they're more expensive. Now another set of digits you need to know about are the volts on the battery pack. And you can see right here, it's 12 volts. Now that tells you the amount of power that you have in your hands to get the job done. Got a lot of work to do? Get a big tank with a lot of power like this 18 volt. Just hanging a few pictures or drilling a few holes? Stick with a smaller side. So let's talk about the true test of a good drill. How does it feel in your hands? It shouldn't be too heavy and it should be balanced properly. And if you have a lot of overhead work to do, it should feel like a natural extension of your arms. Also, your finger should land naturally on the trigger. And on the subject of price, drills that appear the same can vary greatly in cost. That's because different companies construct their tools for different users. For example, Rigid Milwaukee and Bosch are made to handle the rough and tumble work that the pros do. Consumer brands like Ryobi, Skill, and Black & Decker are great for the average homeowner. Remember, no matter what size or power drill you choose, just make sure it's fun and easy to use. And hey, maybe you can finish all those weekend projects you or your spouse has been putting off.